per game for the team. This is to left. Rooker tumbles and makes the catch. Brent Rooker, never going to be much of an asset in the field, but making plays. That's how it's all about here. And Josh Donaldson continued his uh, return to Toronto. You know, got the big ovation. It's another home run, a nice opposite field home run here is 24th homer. Bailey Ober gave up four earned runs in this game, but he's got 10 starts with fewer than four earned runs up until today. Nice run that he was on. Giovanni Moran, unfortunately, walked four of the seven batters he faced, so not a great night pitching. Not really a great night in high minors for the Twins either. But Austin Martin here, uh, you see he gets a single, uh, kind of doing leadoff guy stuff, which is sort of how he profiles right now. Uh, came into tonight with a 408 on on-base percentage, and then here gets his 14th stolen base of the season. Uh, and speaking of on-base percentage, I think the, the guy that comes to mind most there is Edouard Julien. Uh, but also power, 17th home run of the year against the lefty here. Uh, he entered tonight with a 433 on-base percentage and holding his own against same-sided pitches. As you see there at the bottom, left down left, he's got an 813 OPS still. Much better against righties, but um, definitely not a guy who's going to have to be platooned uh, the way he's playing. Aaron Sabato on a 3-0 count here goes deep. His 19th home run of the year. I think the uh, camera guy might have taken the inning off because they didn't switch the outfield on this swing, but you can see the pitcher kind of glare at him <laughs> swinging on 3-0. Uh, but Sabato, that's 15 home runs in his last 35 games overall. Just an insane run that he continues to be on. Sawyer Gibson Long was pitching for Cedar Rapids tonight. Six and a third innings quality start tonight. Seven hits, three runs, one walk, eight strikeouts. He now has 134 strikeouts in 97 innings pitched. As you can see, they're getting a strikeout looking. This man on second base with one out. So a huge strike out there. And then strikes out the final batter he faces there, that breaking ball diving out low and outside. And then big fell out the plate here, but he goes way up top to get him swinging at the high cheese. There again, that was Sawyer Gibson, long pitching. Down in the FCL, that's Mike Paredes, the Twins' 18th round pick with the great outings, two innings, perfect innings, five strikeouts. Chase Petty's second outing there, you see he gives up three runs but strikes out four. And then Christian McLeod, this was his pro debut, also a 2021 draftee, strikes out five in an inning and two-thirds, two walks, one hit there. And next up, let's go to Drew Maggi, big leaguer. Congrats, you're a, you're a big leaguer. And my heart, everything, I was... I mean, the emotions right there were just crazy. She, I mean, it means everything to me, you know, uh, just 11 years of, of hard work and, you know, just a lot of ups and downs through, you know, just personal life and, and baseball and, you know, family. And there's just been so many people that have kept me going because, you know, 11 years, you, I thought my career was over you know, 20 times and something would always happen, you know, whether it be something small from, you know, my mom texting me, you know, keep going or, you know, a friend like, you know, we believe in you or just myself just trying to, you know, find some sort of motivation and, you know, something always would happen to where I would get a small chance or, you know, little chance at all to, to make something happen. And, you know, I was fortunate to just kind of take some of the small opportunities and, and, you know, make them obviously bigger and, you know, get seen and, you know, people started to, to notice a little more and, you know, it's just, it's just, it's crazy. It's, you know, I've been crying all day. I mean, my, it's, it's been, it's been crazy. It's crazy to think about. I called my, my dad and, you know, I, I use some language, but I, I told him, you know, I'm a big leaguer. And, you know, the phone was kind of silent for a second. I was like, oh, did I lose him? Like, Dad? And he didn't respond like, Dad, I'm a big leaguer. And he was just breaking down. My, my mom, was, it was on speed, but he put it on speaker. My mom was right there. She started yelling, and, and then I started yelling, and it was... And then my, I called my brother and he was all emotional and, you know, I have five brothers. So, you know, each of them got a call and yeah, it was, it was just awesome. I told all my friends, I've been getting texts from old teammates that, you know, I don't even like haven't talked to in years and just saying congrats. And it's, it's just been an awesome, 
you know, a couple hours here. 